I'm going to do a rant on the White House. Um, whoever is doing the White House, um, we the people, you know, uh, voice petition for the White House. And I think the only, and I don't know if this has always been around, but it seems like with the Occupy movement going on, that they would want to have a way for the people who are out there basically protesting and trying to get Mr. Obama's attention a way to be heard. And when you have a White House website that basically is throwing out 404 errors that allows people to create a petition that then basically shows no signatures when people sign up and vote, their petition page is broken. And I have set up a petition yesterday. I sent out 50 emails to um, some close colleagues. All right. Oops, that's the wrong one right here, asking them to sign a petition, okay? And I know for, for a fact that um, I have at least, at least 10 of them have signed already. However, what's happening is, and I've discovered this, is a couple things. One is, if you're on Chrome, if you go to this petition, 50% of the users, this page is not going to load. I believe it's done in Flash, and there's some sort of issue in Bug, but it's not loading. It will load in, in Firefox, but it's not loading in Chrome, and it's, or actually, it's not loading in IE either, because that was a friend of mine saying it wouldn't load. And to give you some um, evidence on this, here is, um, sorry, here's Souls. Where is, um, go down here. Um, so here are responses from people who've signed up, okay? Um, and um, I don't know if you can see them all. There you go. Uh, these are people that I've talked to that have the, the part of my friends the network that I know have signed up. But but like my friend Soul who said, sorry, I keep getting, you know, and I even sent out an email, right, saying votes are not getting registered, you know, yada, yada, yada. If I show you clicks on my petition, here's the FC, 35 friends. I know 35 friends have actually gone there. If they've gone there, I know they've signed up. Okay, my friends wouldn't go there and then just like, oh, okay, interesting. Now, obviously, if they're getting a 404 error, they may not, okay? And I'm not going to go public with this dumbass campaign, right? Um, when, uh, you know, when it's not working. Here's some more fail. Fix. Fix this, President Obama. Please watch this video. Fix this. Here's your contact the White House. White House. Now, this is funny, all right? So, one, it says, all right, if you want to contact the White House, there's nothing here to contact you, okay? It says, contact the White House. It's kind of like, all right, um, your email thing should work. It doesn't work. You can, well, I'm going to phone. I guess I'm going to phone and see what happens, too. Visitor comments. Why do you have a feedback form on here? Okay? And here is like, you would think that if you, if you right-click to your, you know, and send back to info, right? Info at the White, White House, uh, due to the overwhelming response. So, so... If, if you're getting an overwhelming response with email and you don't provide people, sorry, a place to give feedback, right, then obviously you don't want it. So you don't, you know, and, and, and if you have a website, Mr. Obama, that's not recording votes, right, so you're creating the illusion that voice voices are important and yet you're not providing it because why would anyone write and support a petition that hasn't any votes it's kind of like hey and i don't know if this is a con i hate to pull this out as a conspiracy and i don't think it is i just think it's ineptitude coding right i don't think maybe he's a republican maybe you hired a web developer that's republican that's trying to screw you over i mean i don't know i would fire that person whoever is responsible who is ever your it person involved in we the people needs to be fired in my opinion because he, he, he has put up a product that makes you look bad, right? And when you've got someone, um, where is it, Sol? Where are you, Sol? Where's your Twitter, right? When you got someone with 30,000 followers basically emailing you and saying, are you dumb? Why are you doing this, right? I'm not... I'm not dumb. I know what I'm doing it, and I'm actually doing it as a as a way to see if I can get Empire Avenue folks behind this um, and promoting this. But if I can't get votes registered, it's not even point to getting them behind this. I'd hate to waste their time. So fix your website. All right. Allow people to voice their opinion, Mr. President.